I have a question for you. How many leads do you generate from LinkedIn each and every single month? If you're like many of the people I talk to, especially when I'm speaking on a live event, I'll have people come up to me and say, you know, Melanie, LinkedIn just doesn't work for me. I've been using it for years and I just haven't gotten any business from it. Is that something that you've said? Or maybe that you're just not getting enough leads from LinkedIn? The reality of it is, it's not that the tool isn't working, it's that you haven't learned how to maximize that tool. You haven't found a way to comfortably start conversations with your prospects on LinkedIn. You have this tool available to you, one that can help you fill your sales pipeline. But if you don't know how to start a dialogue, how to create rapport, and ultimately build relationships with your prospects on LinkedIn, you'll likely have fallen into these three types of LinkedIn users. Now, you might even recognize yourself in one of them as I describe them. Now, the first one is the sales pitcher. These are the people that will send you a connection request and immediately after, send you their sales pitch. So essentially, they're just filling your inbox with spam the moment after you connect, and you don't wanna be this person. The second type is the people that connect with you on LinkedIn and never follow up. They never have a conversation. I call these the ghost. Many people accidentally fall into this trap, which makes it very difficult for them to generate business. Just because you're connected with somebody, if you've never taken the initiative to have a conversation with them, you can't actually expect business to appear out of nowhere. It's kind of like going to a networking event, meeting people, shaking hands, collecting business cards, going home and putting them in a drawer and never following up. You wouldn't expect business to magically appear from that. The third type of LinkedIn user that's not getting any results or very limited is the social butterfly. Now, these are the people that everybody likes. They're nice people. They engage with your posts but they keep everything online. Maybe you're engaging with people's posts. Maybe you're posting on LinkedIn and even other social networks, but you're never moving those conversations or those relationships forward and ultimately requesting to have an offline conversation. The social butterfly is the complete opposite of the ghost. They know their leads, prospects, and clients are on LinkedIn, and they're investing time in engaging with them, but they're getting stuck. They don't know how to move these conversations offline. In the B2B world, if you offer any kind of professional service, you know that you need to have an offline conversation before somebody says, yes, sign me up, I'd like to be your client. Because ultimately, it's offline that you get to know them, that you get to understand what's going on with them, what's going on in their business or their life, depending on whatever product or service that you offer. And also, that you've got the opportunity to build enough rapport and trust so that you can offer a solution to their problem. Now there is one more type of LinkedIn user and these users are extremely rare. They literally make up less than 1% of LinkedIn users, yet they're generating 99% of the business. It's not the 80-20 rule on LinkedIn, it's the 99-1 rule. I call these people the strategist. These are the users who get all the business. They have the leads coming to them and seem to be getting along without any troubles at all. When you've done this correctly, you become like this magical creature, but almost nobody is talking about how to do this. Now, don't get me wrong. There's a lot of people that are talking about how to spam, how to pitch, how to use LinkedIn automation, but how to become a strategist, very few are talking about. Now, here's some of the results that a strategist experiences. Their messages are getting a response. They're actually building relationships with their connections. They're moving those relationships to offline conversations because they've successfully built enough interest, trust, and credibility that prospects are willing to have a conversation with them. The strategist is consistently and predictably generating new clients from LinkedIn. So let me share with you the secret of the strategist. They deploy the link method. This is a proprietary method that I teach, which shows you how to go from finding a brand new prospect to moving that conversation offline where you can have a sales conversation. It's only then that you can learn about your prospect's problems and then offer a solution. A sales conversation should never happen through LinkedIn messages. What should be happening through messages is getting to a point where you have generated enough interest that a prospect is actually willing to speak with you, where you have warm calls instead of cold calls. Now in this video, I'm gonna show you the link method. 
By the way, for those of you that don't know me, I'm Melanie Dodero. For the last decade, I've been training companies large and small across the globe on how to build a powerful presence on LinkedIn, as well as strategies needed to generate leads from LinkedIn consistently. So if you have a professional and client-focused profile, you're ready to get started generating prospects and building relationships on LinkedIn. Moving relationships with prospects along too fast or even too slowly on LinkedIn can negatively impact your lead generation results. So to help my clients achieve this delicate balance, I created the Link Method, which is a lead gen system I developed specifically for LinkedIn. And when followed, these five crucial steps turn LinkedIn into a predictable lead generator. So let's dive into step one of the Link Method, and that's to find prospects highly targeted prospects. LinkedIn's filled with your ideal clients and you can find them in a number of very easy ways. LinkedIn offers you a fantastic ability to find prospects through its advanced search function. Now the search filters differ depending on the level of LinkedIn membership you have. For example, Sales Navigator offers the most robust set of filters enabling you to perform highly targeted searches. Now you can still do searches with a free or a premium account, you just don't have as much targeting capabilities. But for many, it's more than enough. You can then save your most effective searches with the saved search function. This allows you to get search alerts directly from LinkedIn when new leads match those set of search parameters. LinkedIn will compile a list of leads and prospects and send them directly to you. Step two is to connect by sending a personalized connection request. When you locate an ideal prospect, you need to send them a connection request in order to be able to message them further. What you put in your connection request message will largely determine whether they accept your invite. You must personalize your connection request and give them a reason why they should connect with you. To write a personalized message, start by viewing the person's profile. Your goal is to learn about what is important to them personally or professionally and then write an effective request, beginning the message with something personal to create immediate connection and make sure it's 100% relevant to them, about them and not you. Step three is to engage in dialogue. This next step consists of establishing rapport and starting a conversation with your new connection. After they accept your connection request, you send them a thank you message. It'll give you a chance to keep the conversation going. Continue building rapport with them by starting a light dialogue with them, getting them to talk about themselves, maybe asking them a question. Step four is building relationships through adding value. Most people never communicate with their LinkedIn network and without communication, it's impossible to build relationships. A thank you message alone won't achieve that. You need to send additional messages and you need to provide some value to your new connections, value in advance to continue the momentum. Now, when I say provide value, I don't mean pitching them your solutions. By providing value in advance, you position yourself as someone that's credible and knowledgeable. Now, this often looks like a highly tailored piece of content to their industry. It might be something that speaks to their top of mind problem. At this point, ask for nothing at all in return. And I would encourage you not to simply send a link to an article, rather kind of tease them with the benefits of the content that you wish to send them and ask if it's something that they'd like to receive. Now in doing this, it's vital that you use targeted content. So for example, if I was targeting financial advisors, I might create the financial advisor's guide to attracting high net worth clients on LinkedIn. And I would ask them, is this of interest to you? And if so, I'd be happy to send it over. Now, step five is to move those conversations offline. You need to move the conversation offline as this is where you're gonna to get to know them. It's only in an offline conversation that you're able to get the necessary information to understand their company, to understand their challenges and the things that they're facing. Now, if you've established rapport, if you've provided value and you've begun to build some trust with your prospects, many of them will be willing to have an offline conversation with you. It's only offline that you should propose a solution. Once you've had a chance to get to know your prospect, understand their challenges, and when appropriate, offer your solution. It's offline that you convert a prospect to a client. LinkedIn will become an incredibly powerful lead generator for you when you use the right messaging and when you stop collecting connections and actually start building relationships. Thanks so much for checking out this video on how to find, engage, and convert ice cold connections into paying clients. When you understand exactly the right messages to send and when to send them, LinkedIn can become your top 
Client Generator.